Capricorn, what's up? Welcome to your reading. This is the Capricorn Sun Moon Rising and Venus. Great. All right, this person is manifesting a new opportunity with you. Okay, they're practically trying to manifest. Practically, they're ready to reach out to you. Okay. Magician here, overall. Okay, so this person here is very, very attracted to you. First of all, because we do have the Queen of Wands at the bottom of the deck, so this person is very attracted to you, and uh, they see you as very confident. They see you as in your power. You could be somebody who's just doing your own shit. Okay, you don't really give a fuck to them. All right, and uh, I feel like you're somebody who's just loving yourself, which is why this person is getting very attracted to you. So there could be a manifestation that's coming in uh, for you, okay, but with the magician here, this person is definitely in control of the situation and they feel they can make whatever happen with you. With the seven of swords here, again, the same old shit, different day, trying uh, different approaches, okay, uh, this person is trying to, again, sneak back into your life, okay, in their feelings. Um, they could be running away from commitment. This person here could be running away from giving you something stable, secure, or they just keep doing that, okay? They're on and off, on and off, in and out of your life. Try to get back again, ready to get back again. But this time around here with the Page of Pentacles, they have a very small, 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 teeny, mini breadcrumb offer to you, okay? So this Page of Pentacles are light because it's something stable, secure. So they're not fucking around with the Seven of Swords here. I mean, which I otherwise would have said, but it's just like using a lot of strategy so this person could be very cunning you know someone very smart very crafty but again their intentions with the page of pentacles are good okay they want to reach out they want to probably meet you face to face okay and uh, they could be wanting to travel to you but they want to give you a gift okay but this is definitely reaching out with communication like hey i have something to offer you this is definitely something you can trust me with Four of Pentacles here, yeah. I feel that this person here is still closed off, okay? But I do feel that more than being closed off, this person is holding on to you, right? I don't feel this person is letting you go. No matter how much this person is away from you, if you're not in communication, if you're not talking to them, or if uh, this person is just goes to you, whatever it is, I feel this person has not let you go. They're holding on to you pretty tight. Six of Wands. See, I didn't even ask a question. They want victory, success with you. And this person here, I'm getting someone here who probably is definitely wanting your attention because you could be ignoring them, okay? But at the same time out here, this person definitely wants something. They want to win. They want to make this happen with you, okay? They want to move forward. Let's see, what's the Seven of Swords here? Why is the Seven of Swords here? What's the Seven of Swords here? Ah. Typical negative pattern, right? That's you, Capricorn. But you could be dealing with also a Capricorn. Uh, but um, this person has a very um, heavy codependency. Uh, not actually, I wouldn't say that. I think this person here, no matter how much they try, they can get rid of this negative pattern. They can rid get rid of this devil energy here. But it's like no matter how much they love you, right? Something or the other either keeps them restricted, keeps them bonded bonded because of which they come it's like a touch and back they come towards you they want everything with you but it doesn't work out so you're like you're like at the end of commitment with them like not the end you're like the words you know to get committed with them or to be with them but then again there's this restriction that they feel that you know what i can't make it happen with uh, capricorn and then they run back again what's the page of pentacles What's the page of pentacles? They feel they're restricted because of something, but actually they can break those chains and they can break that bond. Whoever, this could be another third party situation. Uh, this could be uh, their family, whatever, their people's opinions, whatever is stopping them from coming towards you, they can break it, but it's going to take a lot of effort and a lot of strength. What's the pentacles? What's the page of pentacles here? Two of pentacles here. So they could be contemplating, they could be juggling an idea, okay? This person is just fluctuating. So they want to reach out to you, but it's like then they don't. They want to reach out to you, but then they don't, okay? So they're trying to weigh out the pros and cons. They're trying to, uh, you know, they haven't made a decision yet, okay? Uh, they could be juggling you with another person out here, but I feel that they're juggling the opportunity of coming towards you, okay? So there's a lot of procrastination from this person's side out here. Should I, should I not, should I, should I not? Why? Because with the higher venture, either this person is married or this person wants marriage with you or they know that if they come towards you, it's got to be marriage, otherwise you're not going to entertain them. Uh, what's the four of pentacles here? What's the four of pentacles in their feelings? Why is the four of pentacles in their feelings? King of Pentacles, this person is holding back from commitment. 
this person is holding back from commitment for sure and they're not doing anything about it so they're trying to see things from a different point of view a different perspective but what i'm getting here is someone called you know what if it's gonna happen it's gonna happen okay but i'm not gonna make any move physically or i'm not gonna take any action it's a very no intention action card you know uh where um sorry it's a very no action intention card where i'm not gonna do anything about it uh, I'm just going to let it flow, okay? And if it's meant to be, it's meant to be, okay? But at the same time, I want to reach out to Capricorn in my same sneaky ways. They definitely want success with you, okay? Now, right now, their intentions are with the death of this person is going through a huge, huge, huge transformation. Huge transformation here. The death card is an ending somewhere. So, I don't feel that this person here is wanting to end things with you here, okay? Uh, I think that this person here is going through a lot of changes, okay? Those changes that uh, could be going through within your relationship, okay or just changes overall they're going through a lot of alterations in their life okay and um, if this person has ghosted you if this person um, is not talking to you then know that they're going through a lot okay the death is almost like an entire life alteration okay but yeah whatever they're going through whatever changes they're making this is pretty permanent okay so yeah this is telling me that this person here is probably ending things somewhere else it could be ending things somewhere else also, okay? But uh, a significant transition, okay? They're going through a very tough phase and they're end ending a phase and entering a new phase. With the Page of Soldiers, their intentions are to keep an eye on you, okay? They still want to keep an eye on you, okay? Uh, they still want to watch you from a distance. They want to stalk you on social media, okay? Uh, they want to start a new phase with you right now, okay? Because with the Six of Wands here as the overall card, okay, uh, this person wants victory success with you, which we saw in the past also, okay? I think this person's really dying for your attention here. Traveling could be involved here, okay? This person's almost like, I'm ready to move forward, whatever. I think this is a good thing because you need to give this person this transition time, okay? This change time because it's a huge shift in their life, okay? Uh, could be ending negative habits, negative patterns, whatever, back and forth, whatever it is, right? But yeah, uh, with the page of swords, I feel they want to keep an eye on you, okay? They could be just asking people around. Uh, they could be watching your social media here. And with the emperor here, very rigid energy. Very rigid energy, lacking flexibility. They're not adaptive. Uh, they wanted my way or the highway. Yes, someone here who probably wants commitment with you. They want structure stability. Someone who has a solid foundation. But they're damn rigid, you know. They don't want to change. They, it, it's very difficult to stay with someone like this, you know, because this is someone who will get it their way only, you know. So maybe they want all this with you here, but they just, there's no um, movement. What's the death here? Let's see, what's the death here? What are they ending or what is ending in their life? What's the death card here? Clap for the death. Clap for the death. Clap for the death. Clap for the death. Yeah, see, I told you, 10 of wands here. This person is ending, they are in their life at a point where they are uh, probably ending a huge burden in their life, okay, with the 10 of wands here. There's a huge cycle in their end. So these are kind of responsibilities that these responsibilities probably are some of them which they just have to carry, you know. This could be someone who probably takes up a lot of load. They lack delegation. They want to do everything on their own. That's just how they like it. It should have been one at a time, but this person here has too much on their plate all of a sudden. And now uh, it's like, till I don't finish this, I'm not going to be able to approach Capricorn. What's the page of swords here? So while they do that, they still want to keep an eye on you. This could be a lot of pressure, a lot of burden from family also, from their family. Probably they want them to get married. Probably they don't want uh, you and them together, something like that. I'm just feeling a lot of pressure and burden from other people. Uh, what's the page of swords? What's the page of swords? Page of Swords. See, Page of Swords. While being single, while being independent, while being on their own, they still want to keep an eye on you. So I don't want to let you go and I don't want to give you what you want. Honestly, that's just how it is. Very selfish energy, very selfish energy. They see someone who will keep an eye on you. At the same time, they'll probably just enjoy attention from other people or, uh, you know, just somebody who just wants, they just love being single, you know. This person is not in a giving energy. They're more in a I'm okay where I am in a very self-sufficient energy. They're very contented where they are, okay? So they don't, uh, they're not in a hurry to be in a relationship with you or they're in no hurry to be committed, whether it be you to anyone else here. But they'll still keep an eye on you, okay? Uh, see how defensive they are. They're not going to stop, uh, they're, they're not going to have their guards down. 
What's the emperor here? 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 Two cards. So they want to move towards uh, walking towards uh, this connection here, okay, with the six of swords here. Uh, they definitely want to work on this connection, that's for sure, okay, and they want to move towards you. But again, with the same, with the, the problem here is that this person here is very rigid, okay. So they won't take action. They want to travel towards you. They want to work on this connection, but it's a very, they want you on their terms, okay. They're hurting with the three of swords here. There's a lot of uh, things that have been said and done. And they're still holding on to that pain. So they can't believe what happened between you both. You know, whether this was a breakup, separation, whether that was a third party situation, whatever it may be, right? But this person here is having a hard time trying to um, stay positive, okay? So this person here probably doesn't even have a very healthy outlet, okay? To uh, let go of their uh, feelings, okay? They probably are someone who lacks forgiveness. This person here is someone here, you know, I can forget but not forgive, something like that. Okay, so there is a brand new beginning between you both here. Okay. Um, there is a wish come true for you. Okay, what are the blockages are, right? I think the blockages are mellowing down, is what I'm getting here. This is like if, if you had a dream or a wish come true that these you both would talk, then yes. Uh, there is a wish come true here, but I do see... Um, Wow, there is a brand new beginning between you both. It may start off very, very small. But Capricorns, I don't know why. You know what? For your reading also, I had read that this person here is ready to commit to you, but it's all hidden. This person will come towards you, okay? This person here will come towards you and you will be at a crossroads about whether you want a commitment with this person or not here. Because probably, eventually, it's going to be like a lot going on behind the scenes. A lot of it is going to be hidden, you know? A lot of it is going to be hidden. Maybe you don't trust this person is what I'm getting here, okay? You probably are like, you know what, there's a lot of, uh, I need to do more research here. So I feel that whatever blockages were there between you both, eventually things are getting better. You're, you're, you're going to move towards your wish fulfillment here. You're going to have to make a choice, okay? It's all going to depend on you about what you want to do. It's like, a, it's, it's like you need to make a choice this way or that way here. Because there is something that is going to get, uh, this person is going to come towards you with commitment. Dude, what the fuck? But... It's going to be very significant, whatever this hidden knowledge is. And this hidden knowledge is definitely about marrying you. And you're going to have to make a choice about do you want this with this person or not. Why would you not want it? You know what? For a lot of people, I think that this has been like a long coming. That's the change here. See? That's the change here that this person is going through. Wow. <laughs> wow. Your Capricorn reading was also where I told you that this person wants to commit to you. So, yeah. Looks like Lenormand is on point. All right, guys. So that's what I have for you. And uh, leave your comments below. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.